But all these, but all these drivers, all these drivers that be complaining about the money, complaining about how brokers be in their pockets, complaining about how the companies don't don't give them their money, complaining about uh complaining about how these uh uh uh, dispatchers ain't ain't running them to get no money and all like that and they quit or whatever whatever or they jump out what's up youtube welcome back to breaking truckers that's all of a sudden at age what 60 he's just gonna break bad yeah so let, let's see how them tears gonna be flowing when you get into when you get into regular uh regular work life walmart restaurants you know what i'm saying you don't you don't have no Right, you you don't have no um, uh, you you don't have no uh, you don't have no degrees. You don't have no you don't have no degrees. You got you got influencers over here telling you, no, nah, you don't need a degree to drive a truck, which you don't. But but if you don't have your driver's license, <laughs> then what? <laughs> you you don't have your driver's license, then what? You can't do Uber. Cause you don't have no driver's license. Maybe you could do DoorDash because now they say you don't need a car to do DoorDash. <laughs> Who the fuck going to be on a fucking bike delivering some fucking food if you're not a teenager? I'm not. I'm not going to be a 50 year old man on a motherfucking bike. Here you go. Here's your DoorDash. I'm not doing that. Drop it. That's teenage right there. That's 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 20 somethings. That's that's college kids. They do that. I'm a I'm a 50 I'm a 50 year old man in my twilight years. I'm not riding on no motherfucking 10 speed delivering the motherfucking DoorDash. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. You didn't save your money like you supposed to. I mean, don't get me wrong. I I don't get me wrong. I I was I was a victim of that too. I I should have started way back in the day. You know what I'm saying? I got my vices. You know, I go you know, I, you know, my vice is the casino. I know what my vice is. You know, it's, it's not drugs. It's not alcohol. I know what my vice is, but I know now in my twilight years, I know to put some fucking money away. I know to get insurance on myself. I know how to get in. Uh, I know to get life insurance on myself. I, I know to make sure that my son can fucking find me and bury me when I, well, don't even, I, I told him he don't even need to bury me. Shit, cremate me. Use the money, use, use the money, use the money that you get from my insurance, man, to make you a better life. That, that was the whole point. That, that was the whole point of my existence to make sure that you, that you live no, 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 no. Cremation, a grand. That's it. He can put me up on a motherfucking, he can put me up on a motherfucking pedal store. He can, but he can say, dad, I love you and, and spread my ashes over his favorite place or whatever. I'm good. I'm good. You know, I mean, and wonder why I'm saying, and wonder why I'm saying that is because like when, when people get buried, they tend to, they tend to leave the mind. You know what I'm saying? It's just like my grandmother. I, I I said when I was young, when she got buried, I used to go to her grave like all the time, once a month. I used to go once a month. Then it dropped down to every so often. Then it dropped down to Mother's Day. And then it just kind of faded after that, you know? So I, you know, my, now my mom's, she said she want to be buried. So I'm going to have to, you know, me and my sister, we're going to have to, you know, uh, 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 grant her riches. You know what I'm saying? She wants to be buried. But for me, like I said, for me, nah, nah. Yeah, I mean, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I mean, you know, just, you know, pre made me put me in the urn or something like that. Put the best dad ever or <laughs> whatever. You know what I'm saying? you know but uh but yeah man but this dude you know i mean this dude these people out here you know they they just don't know how to put they they don't know how to put things together the everybody on motherfucking social media over here making trucking like 
oh, well, you can get in here, make money and all like that. Then they making trucking like, oh, well, if you was a felon, this, this is an easy, easy, easy job to get into, which quite as kept it is because they got they got truck driving schools in prison. They got they got truck driving schools in prison. Nigga go to pr nigga go to prison for about eight I mean for about eight years or whatever whatever, and they come back out and the first thing and the first thing that a prison do, they're like yeah we'll we'll get you your your CDL. But while you was in prison, you ain't never had no license. What was the point of you keeping your license? Your license expired, so now you got to go back and relearn how to drive. I had somebody ask me. They said, yo, do you need to get your driver's license first before you get your CDL? I was like, that's a good question. Because I I, I would assume, yo, I, I would assume it's they're both the same, right? I mean, if you go and if you go to CDL school to go and get your CDLs and you don't have a license, and you go and get your CDLs and you get them, do you really need to do a do you really need to go to a regular driving school to get, you know, your, your regular license? Or do you need to get that first? I guess. I don't know. I had to look into that. That that'd be a good episode. I had to look into that. Um, but but yeah, man. I mean, you got everybody, you got all these TikTok females, all these TikTok males over here bragging about what trucking is about. And all like that, but they're not talk. They're not telling you what what will happen if you lose. What will happen if you lose your license? What will happen? What will happen if 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 you get a, another trucking job? None of none no none of you new drivers know about Legal Shield lawyers or anything like that. When y'all get out here, y'all don't. Y'all get out here. Y'all get y'all y'all get y'all CDLs and y'all get out here and y'all start playing. Oh, and you already mentioned you already mentioned yourself in the beginning of the video. Oh, I don't normally make videos like this. I I, I usually make you know jokes and I, I make jokes and do videos like that. That that's what y'all do. Y'all get in the truck and y'all joke around. Y'all don't take this shit serious. Y'all don't take y'all y'all don't take this shit serious. Y'all none of none of y'all do. Y'all be on live making live streams singing dancing hands not on the wheel and all like that making making live ass tiktoks talking into the camera answering questions talking to your cohorts and you supposed to be driving driving but no the first thing y'all do y'all want to go ahead and do a live feed and say hey you know look what i'm doing yada 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 and uh oh oh and and you this and that and, uh, oh oh Oh, well, where are you heading to? I'm I'm heading to uh this field, Georgia. Oh, I'm heading over there to get loaded. Yada 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 yada. Y'all playing, man. That this, this ain't this job ain't about play play. That's why y'all get in a whole bunch of trouble. Big G's got it locked. Boy. Don't you want me all